Hey, what's going on? I had a subscriber request for a question. I uh, wanted me to do a video on it. Um, <clears throat> he said he went to the store about a half mile up the road. And uh, he got there, decided to check his oil level when he came out of the store. His oil level was good, but he said, my dipstick and my oil smells like gas. Why? Do I have a problem? And so I responded back, the reason it smells like gas is because you went on a very short trip to the to the store. You shut it off. You went inside. You came back out, checked your oil, and then you hopped back another half mile to your house, so a total of one mile. And the engine didn't have a chance to get up to operating temperature. So the fuel was actually washing out the cylinder, and it gets past the piston rings and into the crankcase. The vehicle didn't get up to operating temperature, which would evaporate the, the fuel that's in there. So you always have a little bit of fuel in there, but you won't smell it because the vehicle's up at operating temperature and it evaporates. Um, that is like the main cause, short trips, not driving it. Um, another cause would be, you know, misfires or spark plugs. It's not burning everything in the combustion chamber. It goes past the piston rings. Um, you know, your sensors are going crazy. Um, but that's the two main causes. Mainly is people drive short trips. They don't let the vehicle op get up to operating temperature. Um, so I hope that helps. Uh, remember, if you're going to drive it, start it up. Let the high idle come down and then you can proceed accordingly. Let the vehicle come up to operating temperature while you're driving. More than a mile. Um, full operating temperature. That way it gets rid of all that stuff in there and, it, and it's not doing uh, damage to your vehicle in the long run. Anyway. Hope that helps. I appreciate it, guys. I'll see you on the next one.